guys, welcome back to another video, and in today's video we're going to be playing some Platform Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Um, in today's video we're going to be playing a game mode called Rando Ops, where it's basically the same as normal guns and graveyard ops, except you spawn as a random character. So, let's hop into the portal and get into the game. Alright guys, um, we've just finished last match and we're in a new one. It looks like our random character for this match is going to be Foot Soldier. And Foot Soldier is actually one of my favourite characters, so I'm quite, quite happy about that. Um, if you guys don't know what Gone's Graveyard Ops is, it's basically you get three areas you can put a Gone or Graveyard down. And then you have to defend it from waves of plants or zombies, as you can see um, by the screen right now. So yeah, it looks like we are, um, it's only wave one right now, so... Then the plants should be quite easy, but as we progress through the end um, wave, the plants will slowly start to get harder. And when it gets wave five, which is the final wave, I believe, um, we will get a couple bosses we have to fight, which I'm not looking forward to. But for now, let's just take out these plants. And wave one has just been completed. Oh, as well, guys, um, to defend your um, grave or garden, you can actually put bots down. Um, but, as, but when you put them down, as you can see by the scattling bot here, there's a timer for them. But as in the other games, you'd um, open packs and you'd get a certain amount that you can use before running out. But in this game, you get infinite, except, you know, there's a timer. It looks like there's wave 2 now, so... Oh god, the chomper! Luckily in um, Gorns and Graveyard Ops, um, the chompers can't actually eat you, which I'm pretty happy about. Because that used to get so annoying in Gordon's um, in Graveyard Ops in Gordon's Warfare 1. I think they got rid of it in Gordon's Warfare 1, actually. I can't remember. I haven't played that game in ages. I might um, record um, me playing Gordon's Warfare 1, actually. Bit of a throwback. Seems I haven't played it in a while. Oh, God. We really aren't doing well defending our um, Graveyard Matic. Right, it's going to throw a stink cloud so all the um, plants around it should get damaged. And I think I will DPG them to finish them off. There we go. Oh, we'll say these plants just keep coming now. Let's take that out. Oh, where does corn come from? There we go. Alright. All right. Where are the rest of the plants? Okay, looks like there's some coming over here. Let's take these out. Throw them stink cloud to do more damage. There we go. I think this is actually the last bit of plants actually because I don't see any plants anywhere else. So let's take out these. They desperate at me! Dang! There's a lot of plants over here. Let's take out the corn. There's another corn. There we go. Oh, and I think I just leveled up to level 2. Wait, level 2? Oh, it's because I'm ad advanced so I've already leveled up once. This and wave complete. And looks like for seeing that none of us got knocked out, we got um, some coins. So let's place more bots down here because it looks like they got destroyed. And wait for the next wave. Wave three. Wait, bonus wave. What? Looks like we have to vanquish a marigold, but looks like we have a timer to do it. Here's the marigold. So I wonder why we still like this. Such a wave just to get married. Oh my god, what the hell? It just stunned me. Yeah. Oh god, I didn't even realize we have a time to get. Right. Running away! Stop running away! I guess that's the point of it. I mean, it's all sort of just crowding around her. She's running! Try to jump shot her. And I failed terribly. Ah, she stunned me again. Good damn it. At least I can still shoot. Hopefully the other two zombies are still defending the... Alright, there's one zombie still defending the um, game of matter, which is good. So we shouldn't lose because of that. I'm running out of time to get this marigold, though. Oh, no. oh damn it. Right, the imps um, caught in a garbage grade. Didn't last long, way. Right? And... Come on, so close! Yes! There we go, we defeated the marigold. And I, did we get like... I don't think we got anything for that. What was the point of that? Oh, it doesn't matter. At least um, the other two zombies are defending the Grave Mathic. Still looks like there's some plants to pick off though. And there we go, wave complete! 
Oh, it looks like we got some more coins for that bonus challenge. Okay, I was about to say, if we done that for no apparent reason, that would be kind of a waste of time. Alright, put some more bots down, let's wait for wave 4 to begin. Looks like wave 4 is just going to be an ordinary wave this time. Thank God. Don't want to be chasing any more marigolds around. Alright, let's take out these weeds. God, it looks like we've got an oak here now. Ooh, that shouldn't be too much of a problem. And I'll just keep taking out these weeds. Let the cat die. And let's put a stink cloud down. Seems like there's like a big horde of weeds here. Go. Oh, and kind of the challenge complete. Didn't even realise. We need some extra bulbs to the prize map. Not that I'm trying to complete it, but okay, still some bulbs to like maybe the next prize map if I want to do that. Well, enough about the prize map. I need to take out these weeds. You keep spitting at me. Stop spitting at me. Right. Oh, the grave aromatics take some damage. Sweet dragon. Uh, just throw another stink cloud. Take out this horde. I have terracotta weed here, so I'm gonna ZPG that. If uh, if we um, will be getting my way. There we go. Alright. Not good though, because it looks like we've already lost um, more than half our health to the Gravematic. But as long as we can keep defending it, that we should be fine. Weeds everywhere. This. Looks like the um, waves on the stair over there. Which one? Who fancy turn to an oak? There we go. And I finished the, um, the last plant is this acorns. There we go. Wave complete. Alright. Now we definitely need to put bots down everywhere because, like I said before, wave 5 you get a couple bosses to fight. So we're going to need a lot of bots to defend. Alright. Let's put some bots down here, and then all we have to do is wait for wave 5 to begin. Alright, wave 5. Plant slots. See what bosses we're gonna get. Oh, just one! Oh no, it's a spooky squash. An elite? What? What's an elite? I've never seen this before. No, no. Looks like there should be one boss, but seeing that it's said elite, I'm going to assume it's going to be, like, extremely powerful. Oh my god, it's already shooting at me! A cauldron bubbles nearby? What? Drop a pumpkin seed in the cauldron! Time for the evil science of soup! Wait, cook the pumpkin seed? I see the cauldron, but where's the pumpkin seed? I assume we get it from the, um... I don't know what the, I don't even know what the boss is called. I think it's called the Spooky Squash. All the plants are wearing um, pumpkins as well. <laughs> well, it looks like there's only um, kernel corns and weeds though, so that shouldn't be too hard. And a chomper, of course there is. Oh, I think this is um, this chomper's carrying the weed. Let's take it out then. Damn it! Is this gonna be like the marigold to keep running away? I've already attacked, to be honest. Well, while the other um, zombies attack the, um, what's it called, pumpkin squash, me and this all-star are going to chase after this um, chomper. What's that even called? The glutinous chomper. A very weird name. Come on, so close. I, I want to save my ZPG just in case. Right, there we go. Pick up the pumpkin seed. And now I assume we need to take it to the um, cauldron. Oh, but the pumpkin seed stopped me from sprinting, so... Thank God there's not a bunch of plants around to stop me from getting to it. And we put in the cauldron. What do we do now? Drink the soup, what? Drink the <coughs> Oh, maybe we, um, we can attack the um, Spooky Squash now, because it looks like we wouldn't be able to do any damage. Yeah, we can't... Oh my God, that's a lot of damage. Three or five everywhere. I wonder how much the ZPG would do. 8,748. Jesus. Looks like I'm going to need to um, keep the all star and just red circle that's around me so we can still do the damage. Oh my god. He's being fire at us. I'd be, be most grateful if we'd stop that, please. Oh my god, I didn't realise that there was a timer above us. Looks like we only have four seconds left of this superpower, I assume. Yep, so the power subs subsides? I've no idea what that even means. I'm gonna assume that means like it's ran out soon. 
Alright, so I assume like another chomp is gonna spawn. Ow! Oh, more creeps. Yeah, I assume there's gonna be another chomp with a seed around that we're gonna have to kill. Oh, and there's a time. There's, um, we have a timer to do this? Seven minutes and 15 seconds left. I didn't even realize that. It's pay more attention to the screen. Looks like we're gonna have to cook another pumpkin scene to get more super. Is it a chomp? Yep, it's a chomper again. And I assume it's just a run. Yep, he's lagging it. Cannot run from me! So close! Yes, the pumpkin seed! Oh no, there's big squashes right there though. Right. I'm gonna take out these corn and weeds so the um, yep can get past. Probably wasn't the, s the smartest thing for the imp to get, it seems that like he has the lowest health. But, what can he do? Right, now we need to put it in and take the soup. Oh, by the way guys, I've switched up the um, recording a bit, so this um, may sound and look a bit different. Let me know if you pe prefer this uh, more than the other um, way of recording. But anyway, let's take up the squash. So yeah, what's right, we need to stand in this red circle that's um, popping around the imp to take the damage to it. Looks like the old stars in there. Doesn't understand that, yeah. Let's get back in the circle. There we go. But all the, all the um, weeds are just dying because my stinks are. Well, we haven't even done half the um, health yet. We've only got four minutes left. Two, one, and we've ran out of the superpower. Right, so now we've just got to wait for another um, trumpet to appear of the seed and repeat the process. The trumpet is almost um, eliminated. Come on. Perfect. Wait. I have got the seed, and now we need. Oh, God, here comes the spooky squash. Right, I'm going to go around this way. The uh, speedy squash can't catch up with me. Right, need to get back to the um, cauldron, but there's a bunch of um, horns to protect it. Come on, almost there. There we go. Right, I'm gonna throw a stink cloud to get rid of these um, corn here. Come on, here we go. I'll drag the sheep. Right, now we need to get over to the. Um, Oh, I've got to oh my god, there was so many weeds. Right, I'm just gonna take out this squash. I have no idea what the rest of my team are. The imps here, I think it's the imps, so that's the damage. There we go. We almost took out half to the squash's health, but it looks like um, we're gonna run out of time because we only have just over two minutes left. Wait, the imp is in, in the circle now, so we should be able to do damage. And we've ran out. Looks like we might just go over to um, Arthur's health though. But it looks like we need to go find, once again, another trumpet to get the pumpkin seed. It's like, um, me and these two zombies have cornered this glutinous chomper. I think that's how you pronounce it. And we've got the pumpkin seed. I've picked it up again. And we're a bit further away from the cauldron I've, um, as we've been the last couple of times. But still should be able to make it. There we go. Now we're just gonna wait for it to bubble. And then we can get the super. Come on, there we go. Drink it. There we go. Now we need to get over to the spooky squash and take them out. Don't think we'll be able to do it though, because we only have 10 seconds left. Come on. Yeah, there's no way we're gonna be able to do it. Oh. I think we just failed because we ran out of time. Yeah. It looks like we failed. We only managed to defeat the four, um, four previous waves. We couldn't defeat the boss. Alright guys, I reckon I'm going to play one more game of um, Rando Ops. And you know what? I'll play one game of Battle Arena because I don't think I've um, shown that on the channel yet. So I'll play one more game of Random Ops and then we'll have one go of Battle Arena. Alright guys, it looks like we're on the same map and we are be uh, being zombies again. 
Looks like this time though I'm gonna be electric slide. I'm not too good for electric slide, but I'm not too bad either. So this hopefully this shouldn't be a total train wreck. But all we have to do now is place some bots down and wait for the wave to begin. Wave one, the plants are growing. Where are the plants though? I don't know over here, right. Put just one lonely weed. But now it's one dead weed. Right. I look at some more plants coming from this way. But I have a very obvious exclamation mark. Just take them out nonetheless. Oh my god, there's a lot here. Send out my tornado, whatever it's called, and set it up. And just like that, they're basically all dead. Let's get some healing from Mr. Heels over here. Take out these acorns. And just like that, the wave is complete. Looks like we don't have to play, play and put any more bots down, so what we have to do now is wait for the next wave. Wave two. There's already a big group plant over here. Looks like I'm gonna have to send out my tornado this time though, so looks like the screens have it covered. I hear a chomper though. Oh, it's right behind me. Yeah, I'll hear a chomper. There we go. The chomper is taken, taken care of. Uh, looks like there's more um, plants coming from this way. I think. No, I guess I'm just hallucinating. Yeah, I could have sworn I saw an exclamation mark over here. Guess not. I can barely find any plants now. I'm not like the green massive. Where are they? Oh, Pelly on. Alright. Once again, it looks like I don't have to use my tornado ability, whatever it's called. Because there's only a few plants left. It's hard to find some of this wave. Just like that, the wave's completed. And oh, we do have some bots to place down this time. Only two though. Looks like um, this team's pretty good. But well, with that being said, we've got to wait for wave three. Wave three, another bonus wave. Stop the squash. Wait, why is he gonna like just completely squash the Rivermatic? Well, that's what I'm gonna assume. It's in his name. Oh my God, it's huge. I think this is the time to use them to turn it. Right, right. It looks like um they've got under control, but wait. Oh, the boss took out the um. Plants. I knew it was a good idea to have this box down. Oh no, not the dandelions. I hate the dandelions. Just run up in your face and blow up. Looks like we've got the squash taken care of though. Because it is gone. Oh my god, just exploded. More weeds at the um Grimmatic though. Oh my god, there's a lot now. And god we've got a good team. Let's take out these weeds here. So we've got more weeds coming over here. Send out the tornado. Decimate it. Wave more. Well, more like electrocute them, but same. Alright. And wave complete. Wow, this team this team is killing it. But looks like we have Oh yeah, we do have some bots to place down. So let's place uh hide super here. And and oh he's already placed a uh, Doctor Heels. Alright, I guess we could use one of those. Now to wait for wave four, I think. Wave four. All right. Looks like nothing special is happening this wave, except for a massive goat running at me. All right. Another oak, but it looks like there's only one, so it shouldn't be that much of a deal. This, I assume, this is going to be a um, thing that tried to turn me into a goat. I just went to Arcane Enigma. Yes, I think it's called Arcane Enigma. Completely forgot. Very good, the rose is gone. That was weird. I'm max level reach! I didn't realise I was level 9. Oh, well, at least I'm level 10 now. Another character challenge complete. I, how am I completing this character challenge? Um, character challenges? I've no idea I even had them. Right, so I'm getting Matic at 95% health, which is pretty good, seems like it's um, wave 4. Hopefully, the um, final boss at uh, wave 5 shouldn't be too hard, though. Because it'd be really annoying if we do this good and then we can't take out the final boss. But for now, let's take out these weeds that will not die. There we go. God, these, um, some of these weeds are very really strong. Check some pothead weeds. There we go. Key shooter. 
And this one got, I think this is the last plant. Yep, wave complete. Now, another challenge, character challenge complete. I have no idea I have these. Let's put a Gatling bot here. And I think that's all the bots we need. Now I'm just going to wait for wave 5 and see what boss we get. And here it is. Which bot? Which bot? Boss. Right, looks like we're not going to get Elite this time, but we are going to get two Queen Sunflowers and two Giga Torchwood. Thank God it's not Elite this time, or we probably would have lost. It looks like the first bot already sp spawned. And I'm a goat! Why wouldn't I be a goat? Right, so let's stay back at the game of Matic until I turn back. There we go. And seeing that the, um, the other zombies are taking care of the bosses, I guess I'll take care of these weeds. And goddamn terracotta we will die. There we go, and oh god, here comes the um, one of the people Torchwood. Torchwood? Torchwood. I don't know why I can't speak today. Let's try my best to take out this Torchwood. He's surrounded by weeds though. I think it's heal weeds, I want him to heal the um, torchwood after all. The torchwood is shooting at me. Oh, dead. Right. Looks like um, our teammates are coming to help me now, which is pretty good. And he's, all, he's um, already lost more than half his health, so it shouldn't be too much of a problem. And. There we go. Took him down. It looks like they managed to take out the other Queen Sunflower, because here comes the second one. Oh, they've been the grave mat. Oh, just a couple of weeds. Right. This shouldn't be too hard to take out. Jeez. Oh no, how comes the Giga Torchwood? Well, the second one, that is. Well, while the space gear goes after that, I guess I'll take out um, all these little plants. There we go. Gonna electrocute this Torchwood while he's stuck on the spot. And just shoot at him. Right, did that quite uh, a bit of hefty damage. I'm gonna back off though, because I'm losing a bit of health. Thank god um, I haven't put a Dr. Heels back here. Well, I thought the Dr. Heels just exploded then, I'm not the same. Right. So, this guy. Looks like he's almost um, done for. And there we go. Wait. Oh yeah, there we go. Right. And the Queen Sunflower was the last boss. There we go! Defeated all the bosses, now it's got a couple weeds to take out. And just like that, the boss wave is completed. And there we go, we've completed Ops. That was a lot better than our last game. Well, our last game was alright, except for the final boss at the end. We were just nowhere near taking that out. But in this game, our team wins. Alright guys, now that I've played the second match and we actually won, I'm going to play one game of Battle Arena, then I'm going to call it a day. Before we go into Battle Arena though, it looks like we've saved up um, quite a few coins from playing Random Ops. As you can see in the top right um, hand corner, I've got 166,000 coins. So before we go into Battle Arena, I'm going to go over to Mr. Reward to try 9,000 and buy some capsules. And our first one's going to be... Oh, a hat for the um, pea shooter called the PG. I couldn't even read that. Right, let's buy another capsule. If we all get a legendary out of this, I doubt it though. Uh, pretty kitty stickers. Uh, not too good though, seeing that it's just two stickers for the sunflower. A green. What skin is going to be? Red hot pepper. Again, not that good, but I'll still take it. it looks like we'll be able to open two more. What's this going to be? A Pegeology collar. I'm pretty sure that's the, um, another piece to the hat I just got a second ago. Right, it's by Final Capsule, and we do get an epic, which is going to be a Kalos Crusader jaw. Again, not that good, but I'll take it. Alright, so let's go over to the multiplayer portal, put Battle Arena in, and let's go play a game. Alright guys, we've just got into a game of Battle Arena, and if you don't know what Battle Arena is, it's basically, it's a 4v4 against the plants and zombies, but basically there are, I think, around 5 or 6 rounds, but each round you get to pick any of the characters out of your team, but once um, you've used that character in a round, you can't use it again, so yeah. Alright, looks like we're slightly outnumbered, because they've got 4 zombies and we've only got 3. Hopefully we should be able to um, take them out though. 
So it's like we've got a nightcap, a cactus, and obviously I'm a pea shooter. So let's take these out. Alright. Go try and take out the imps before they can call in the mechs. Because if we have two mechs running around, that'd be a big problem. So, oh, looks like we've already took out the ease action hero. They're extremely handy. Hopefully he's not being revived. Oh great, there's a um, turret which I need to take out because that will be get annoying very quick. Come on, just jump over here, try and take out this engineer, and there we go, just like that, round one. It's a pretty easy round. Even though we are slightly outnumbered, we managed to pull through and take them out. All right, as you can see now, the pea shooter has gone X over, so I cannot use it again. So I think in this round I'll use Snapdragon. Bless you. Alright. Looks like this time we're not outnumbered. We've got four plants. There we go. We've got a citron, an acorn, and two snapdragons. And the zombies have got... An engineer, two pirates, and an imp. Alright. Round three. I guess I missed a round at the beginning. Not too big of a problem. Seems that we're already winning. Alright. I'm going to try and go around here. So I can't, I won't be taken out um, instantly. Jump over here. Don't let um, be put in the water. A dragon after all. I don't think dragons and water mix too well. Just try and get behind these and flag them. That's a pirate taken out. That is another pirate taken out. And that's the imp taken out. All right, now I've just got to take out the engineer. I think I'm going to take out the entire team. And just like that, we've um, won round um, three. These zombies are really not that good. Alright, as you can see now, the Snapdragon's um, um, got an X over it. So now I'm going to use a different character. And I think this um, round I'm going to use Citron. Alright. What team have we got? We've got a pea shooter, an acorn, a nightcap, and obviously me as a citron. And for the zombies, three foot soldiers and an electric slide. Um, seeing that um, they've not been doing good the past couple of um, rounds, this should be pretty easy. Right. I'm going to do the same thing I did last time, although they might be expecting it this time. But I'm still going to see if I can flank them. And if they do um, spot me, can I just ram them with the ball? Right. Looks like we've already lost the pea shooter. Oh, yeah, they definitely were expecting it. Right, let's put our shield up. But I can't shoot with this, so. Block the, um, block the ZPG. And come on. Oh, so close. Okay, it's, uh, it looks like it's just that foot soldier and the nightcap. I wish the nightcap should be able to take them out. And yes, round four has been won. And I think that's it. I think we've just won. I mean, all I can see is a nightcap right now, so I'm not too sure. And yes, the plants have already won. Even though we only got to see three rounds, we managed to um, win. That was surprisingly easy. I was not expecting that. But there you have it, guys. Yeah, we showcased Random Ops and Battle Arena today. Um, but yeah, that's it for the video. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.